Welcome everybody. Today in this video, I'm going to do a bloom. This is the bloom that I'm doing in this video. It's a gorgeous fall colors bloom that I spun. First I blew it out with my hair dryer and then I spun it. So stick around and uh, you'll see how I did it. Welcome everybody. I'm Carol and my channel is called Carol's Art Room. I've had my channel for two and a half years and I have over 600 videos. So if you'd like to see any kind of um, technique, check it out. So let's get moving and we'll start my bloom that I'm going to do today. See you in the video. All right, so I need to put my house paint pillow down. See how it is. I'm going to check my paint consistency. See, to me, that seems thicker than this. Or it's pretty close anyway. So I will be adding a little more water. Just made up a lot of them. This is Ozo Orange by Amsterdam. This is Artist Loft. Bright red. Pretty red. It's actually their flow acrylic paint. Try this one, see how it goes. And then I have a, this is a uh, Josania Indian Red Oxide. I don't have very much of that one left. I've got a Lemon Yellow um, by Amsterdam. Or no, this is a um, Metallic Yellow, I think. Yeah, Artist Loft. Oh, I got so many lids here. Oh, there we go. Uh, Artist Loft Lemon Yellow Metallic. Never tried metallic yellow before. So I've got a couple of metallic. Well, I've got the yellow and the gold and the peridot green. And I also have a nice a new color that I'm trying. It's supposed to be uh, yellow. It's called Pearl Yellow by Amsterdam. And I have it on my spinner. I am going to spin it and use my blower and blow it dry. All right. Not blow it dry, but blow it out. Yeah, I like it to make, I'm um, not a big mound, but this is my Rust-Oleum Gold. All right, let's get started. 
go out a little more paint around the edges. Okay, so I'm going to put the red first, I think. And some orange. I don't usually do this many colors, but what the heck? Some uh, lemon yellow. Still being seems a bit thick. I think metallics always seem a bit thick. See, they feel heavier, thicker. This other uh, cat orange. Just gonna use it up. And of course, this one's from another pour, and it's thinner. All right, so now I'm gonna put my gold. And these are either semi-transparent or transparent paints. And the mixture that I've mixed these paints with is in my description under the video. Pouring medium, which is a clear house paint that's not tinted and some varnish. This is a metallic peridot green. I'll try this pearl yellow. Doesn't look like yellow, but give it a try. I'm going to use a black cell activator. And I think I'll blow it with my blower, my smaller hair dryer that I have. Hope that's enough. Okay, let's try this. I don't know, I have Payne's Gray.
And I also have black, so I'm just gonna debate, but I might try the Payne's Gray. black on the top. Okay. It's my uh, hair dryer blower. Has a cool setting. Whoa, I think my paint might have been a little thick because it was hard to move. I don't like that there. Oh my God, those colors. Um, I'm gonna blow that again. for it to settle in the middle. Okay, I definitely have to thin my paints down more. But I got some gorgeous colors. This is concave in the middle, so you have to let this Come back to uh, well, it's going to be interesting. The color combinations are really pretty.
was wondering if it's going to move. a spot right there that's not moving. Just trying to get that center part to move. That's not moving. Let's so push it down. It's going to move now. All right, I think I'm just going to spin it now. All right, let's see what we get. Ourselves this way. It's definitely a pretty color combination. This side's good. I just need to get this side spun, so I'm going to go this way now. Whoa, it's almost there. I wonder if I should leave it now. One more. I can just put some white paint here. 
I love it the way it is. Oh, God, I love blooms. That is or outrageous. Sometimes I can't even find the words. Okay, I'm done. Let's see if I can uh, zoom it in for you. i got to get rid of the this paint all over me. And I lost my rag. There it is. Zoom you in. How's that? Very pretty. Look at the gold. Now the green, I guess it blended with the yellow. So they're not very, they're blended. There's a bit of the yellow. Now I'm going to have to remember the way I ordered. I put these down. So pretty. I think it's going to dry nice and shiny. Well, I'm glad you came by for this one. Come back to my art room. Comment below. Ask me a question. I'd be glad to help you out. Subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. The dried results will be at the end. See you then. Hi everybody. I'm just here to show you my dried uh, bloom. I just love the colors and how this one turned out. Beautiful. Look at those gold cells in the middle. The orange coming through and the red. And a little bit of white down there. It dried really smooth. And shiny. There you go. I love this one. Okay, have a great day, everybody. There you go. Close up. See you in my next video. Bye bye.